Needing positivity all around you Many life struggles trying to hold you down When your goal is being great to push through dark clouds And try to tear you down Why they want to tear me down? Ram, gay We in this, in this thing I say up uh, Ram, uh, uh, gang We in this, in this Thing I set up round uh, game. We in this in this thing I set up round uh, game. We in this in this thing I say, hey, what you doing here if you ain't looking for no Aries? We stay turned up. We be talking about them Aries. Gang shit only. Gang turn up for Aries. Pop that shake that turn up turn up for Aries. What's popping, gang gang? Did you miss me? <laughs> I miss y'all motherfucking asses. Hey, boo, hey, if this is your first time to my channel, I'm Mocha. Also, if this is your first time to my channel, look out, baby, I cuss, okay? So if cussing does not work for you, please feel free to get the hell on the out here, right down now, okay? Because this is my shit. This is how we do it, sha da 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 okay? This is my shit. I'm going to cuss. Please feel free right now, right down now. Find another beautiful reader here on YouTube that can further assist you without cussing. Because the way I'm set up, I'm going to do that shit. Alright? Thank you for the likes, the shares, the subscribes, the comments, the love, the donations, the reading requests, the loyalty, the support. Thank you so very much from the most humblest space ever. Alright? Also, if you're a new family member, welcome to the family, y'all. <laughs> we a little dysfunctional, okay? We don't fight and fuss. We leave that shit on other people's channel, okay? But here, we do laugh. We grow. We love. We evolve, okay? We enlighten. Positive vibes only. Positive type teams, all right? This message ain't finna resonate with every damn Aries. Take what does. Leave the rest. If you need a personal reading, that information can be found within the description box below. I ain't put that shit. I ain't copy and paste that shit there for no motherfucking reason. Bitch got techie techie over here. Big copy and paste, okay? So y'all go check that shit out. Also, um... This message will resonate for Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, um, Mercury, okay, as well as the North Node, all right, um, Aries, 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 you guys, this will be your January 2021 message, all right, and also, happy 2021, my baby, we made it, you understand, we made you, and we made it, Aries, with your magnetic, magical asses, Aries, 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 Usually, I get singing songs, okay, for the intuitive message as far as the song. The two songs that I got for you all, okay, was Lil Wayne. A milli, 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 a milli. I'm a millionaire. I'm a young money millionaire tougher than Nigerian hair, okay? Listen, a lot of big, big Aries. Big energy, okay. Um, the second song that I got was OT Genesis. Uh, I be getting to the money. <laughs> Everybody mad. <laughs> I think I'm getting too much money. Everybody mad, okay. So there he is. Everybody fucking mad. Yes, they watching. They mad. They slept on you and you woke they ass up. All right. I feel like this energy as I felt this energy of as we ended. 2020 you guys were really coming into this space of acceptance around what it is that you had to release okay you guys were very clear upon what it was that needs to be released and I feel like for my Aries who weren't or who weren't in that space I feel like we're coming into 2021 with you guys definitely in this space of being focused and really on ready set go okay you're not worried about nobody else's problems you're not worried about the shit in which you can't change you're not worried about someone else's consequences to their actions that they did or did not take okay you're focused on your motherfucking lane where there is no motherfucking traffic okay and you can ride there for free all day and tomorrow all right i definitely picked up on the energy again of this energy with aries pulling back their energy taking back their power okay cutting cords all right and letting the chips fall with the fuck they may i just did pisces and i some of you guys could have pisces in your chart because it was a very similar energy okay with some things um aries i felt a lot of esoteric a lot of esoteric like flow okay i definitely picked up the energy of multi-dimensional beings 
I also picked up the energy again of mastery, the master of transmutation. I also picked up on the energy of using or transmuting your sexual energy. Some of my Aries may be choosing to go celibate, all right? I'm also picking up the energy of some of my Aries are choosing to actually start their businesses and really focus on their business. You're making a decision to be a motherfucking boss, not an employee, all right? I'm also picking up on the energy of some of you guys are surrendering when it comes to trying to make things work or trying to make things fit where they just don't fit. As I am hearing family, okay? For some of y'all, this could actually pertain to family. For some of y'all, this could actually have to do with some type of friendship circle or association, okay? I'm also hearing organization. So for some of you all, you could actually be, and I'm hearing higher knowledge. So I am literally getting the energy of a cult, okay? Some of you guys could actually be studying or actually expanding your occult knowledge. You could actually be offering your services if you are a practitioner to others. I'm picking up on a lot of self-love, a lot of divination, and a lot of protection of your energy. Energetic boundaries, okay? I'm also picking up on the energy of the gift of telepathy. Some of you guys are inheriting new spiritual gifts, okay? And you're taking this time to really get in tune with your gifts. For some of you all, you're feeling like a damn kid before fucking Christmas, and that's okay. Spirit is really calling you to use that energy in order to create. Use that energy in order to dig deep and share your share that wisdom, share your experiences with others. Some of you Aries may be actually launching or releasing a book, okay? I did pick up on the energy as well as a lot of... I, I picked up want uh, some type of like tantric sex tantric healing some of you all may be getting very heavy a uh, very he heavy into tantric healing okay i'm also hearing alchemy for some of you all also i'm hearing alchemic blendings okay so some of you guys could be holistic healers or into herbal divination very heavily i'm also picking up on the energy as well as unexpected income unexpected money okay for some of you all aries you could actually be inheriting something and i feel like this is coming far left you did not see it coming all right there's also some type of truth regarding your genetics that you're going to discover this month all right for some of you all that truth within your genetics have to do with some type of some type of practice or some type of like I'm hearing divination very strongly, like some type of practice that, or something that was like silence within your lineage, okay? This could even be the inheritance of your gifts, but people being afraid of their gifts, okay? There could also be some type of religious shaming this month. I'm also hearing testimony. So some of you all could be in a very testimonial space, or spirit is really calling you to share your testimony. Hence, I am picking up on the, uh, hence I am picking up on the energy of a book or music, okay? Some of you all may be very heavily into music creation, all right? Again, using that energy. Strong emphasis on the sacral as well as the crown the sacral the crown some of you all may feel the need to cover your head this month as well all right aries so your intuitive messages that we wrote down we got high priestess we got copycat how them hoes be they listen a bitch could never copycat all right don't get me fucking started cowardly response music Mobile business, expansion and consciousness, public speaking, investor, manipulation of elements, Nephilim, hidden knowledge, donations, emotional spending, leadership, say less, new love, collaborations, um, Okay, self-made millionaire, subconscious revelations, the mastery of shadows, I'm sorry, the mastery of the shadows, hidden realms, star seed, soul retrieval, business influx, Akashic access, new home, shape shifting, synchronicity, honoring the heart, everybody mad. Envious of your glow up, Reiki master, inevitable separation, observation, inheritance, assets, shaman, cutting cords, medicine woman, manipulation of weather, heart chakra, evil eye, light codes, they all watching, fate thief, tantric healing, Body goes. Come on, body. Yaddy, 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 yaddy. I see you out here, body goes, with your fine ass. 
Aries, I definitely picked up the energy, again, of hitting your mark, meeting your goals, accomplishing your dreams. Actually, also, I'm, I'm also picking up on collaboration, okay? The collaboration with another person. I am hearing co-parenting, okay? I'm also picking up on the energy of someone coming in, again, Someone slept on you, Aries, and you woke their ass up, all right? Um, I definitely feel like this has to do with a Taurus, a Sagittarius, a Leo, a Virgo, or a Pisces. Some of y'all is also a Scorpio or a Capricorn. A big emphasis on fixed energy, okay? So some of you guys could be dealing with a fixed energy, a fixed sign, all right? Someone stuck in their way, someone complacent, someone doesn't want to change, but they expect all of the motherfucking changes out of you, all right? I'm also picking up on the energy of some type of inevitable ending, some type of unexpected ending. For some of you all, this has to do with your job, and I feel like this is actually happening out of your control. I am hearing something regarding paperwork. I'm also hearing investigation, okay? So someone could have, I mean, even hearing sexual harassment, like something actually being investigated behind the scenes, okay? There's a need for you all to observe more and say less, okay? I'm also picking up on the need to document things. This could even be the times in which you come and go from work. This could even be something something having to do with someone in a higher authority. And some of you guys could be getting into it with an authority figure at work. But I feel like this, this person is only... Yeah, some of y'all got a, uh, like a promotion that's coming that you don't see coming. But someone knows that you're about to obtain a blessing. And whoever this is, they're trying to sabotage it. But Spirit is saying you're divinely protected. And your gifts are your gifts. Your blessings are your blessings. They're just that. It ain't a nail motherfucking mad ass bitch, okay? Shout out. Listen. Aries, right now, before we get in our energy, okay? Because there's a lot of hating ass, interfering ass energy with you guys for the month of January. Let's take a moment of silence, okay? We're going to... Moment of silence right now for every mad motherfucker who watching my Aries. Moment of silence for these mad assholes, okay? Let's just have it right now. All right, that's it. Listen, Aries, we don't really give a fuck about these mad ass people, okay? Some of y'all got a mad ass air sign. This person really is waiting for your fall. Someone, someone gets off on seeing you fall. Like, someone gets off on seeing you fall behind or fall backwards, okay? Someone's also making assumptions, or someone could have been making assumptions regarding your plans or why you were moving a particular way. Aries, you are confusing people. You're very unpredictable. Your energy is, your energy. Energy is very 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 magnetic yet it's like it feels like it's impossible to reach to someone okay someone doesn't really know your energy at all I could I, I'm also picking up the energy of someone practicing some of y'all got a close friend of yours that could have been practicing some type of divination or practicing a damn candle magic on you fear not this magic will not motherfucking it will not persevere but whomever this is someone they're saying stay less because someone's going to slip up and tell you what the fuck they've been doing and whoever this is your silence your disconnection from this person is driving them crazy again unpredictable silent moves okay so let's get into it let's get a crystal Crystal Wisdom Healing Oracle message for my Aries for the month of January. Where crystals will be significant to my Aries. Sun will rise in Venus, Mercury, Jupiter in the North. No, you guys got Malachite. All right. That shit flew out of there. Five. Okay. Some of y'all could definitely be making changes as uh, to your diet, your appearance. Okay. This could also be making changes when it... I'm hearing new cards. Some of you guys could be be very careful with overspending this month. Okay, I'm hearing emotional spending. Some of y'all may have some type of unexpected car costs or unexpected car repairs that come up. I'm also picked up on the energy again of donations. Aries, I feel like whatever it is that you're needing help with, Spirit is literally assisting you or putting people, places, and things on your path that's literally like falling at your feet. All right, you guys are really heavily manifesting. You got yeah, y'all y'all manifesting shit this month. All right. Mm -hmm. Malachite The subconscious mind Y'all know we don't chop and screw these oracle messages We read them as is The subconscious mind Malachite brings to light Ingrained programming and toxic beliefs An amulet against pain This is a powerful stone For emotional transformation It stimulates the survival instinct Unconscious programs Or beliefs cause psychosomatic Disease Go willingly into the depths Go, will go willingly into the depths. Therapy may be needed. Your deepest fears become your greatest gifts as hitting abilities come to light. Go where angels fear to tread to bring back insights for your own healing and that of others. Explore your depths. Danger threatens. Not all is as it seems. 
Stand firm in your power. Have no fear. You survive. Protect yourself against all unseen forces or powerful minds that manipulate you. Learn psychic protection. Take a course to call up past life skills. Spread your wings. Do not become embroiled with, char with a charismatic man. Detoxifying your mind, body, and emotions and recognizing deep psychosomatic causes of disease are a path to well-being. The frequency of this stone is earthy to high, good for the uh, heart, base, sacral, and solar plexus. Also good for Scorpios and those with the soul path of transforming your subconscious mind, okay? So this could also have to do, again, with your subconscious beliefs, how you speak to yourself, what you pour into yourself, okay? I picked up on the energy of, uh, I'm picking up on the energy again of soul retrieval for some of you all you're inheriting you're inheriting or you get you you're you're inheriting gifts of the soul from previous lives okay i'm also a very 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 uh very big focus or very very big emphasis on the akashic or access to your or gifts that lie dormant within you through your akashic okay so some of you all your subconscious space may, may be extremely active okay i am picking up on a lot of ancestral some of you all may be connecting with your ancestors okay your ancestors could be giving you information this could also be some type of knowledge to get to the next level big focus again Again, on agricultural agriculture turning back to the land holistic dieting okay a holistic diet I'm also picking up on skincare um, this could this could be skincare this could also be hair products jewelry all right a lot of focus on a lot of focus on um, I'm hearing transmutation Something that you thought was impossible is actually going to turn out way better than what the hell you expected, all right? I'm also picking up on the energy of someone being humbled and you guys getting a front row seat. I'm hearing, I told you so. Laugh now, cry later, okay? So, Aries, some of you all are seeing someone being humbled in your energy. I'm also picking up on the energy as well of really 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 getting in tune when it again the, the a big focus on the gifts your gifts some of you all this is also having to do with self-discovery all right some of you all your words are really holding weight in the month of january be very careful what it is that you're really like really um that you're allowing into your energy this could be the music that you listen to okay this could be the conversations that you're having with people be very careful when it comes to other people projecting their beliefs their fears um their doctrine i'm hearing on to you as well all right, so let's jump into the tarot. Spirit messages do you have for my beautiful, magnetic, magical, powerful ass Aries? For some of you all, also, I am hearing um, business loans. So some of you all could be being approved for some type of business loan, some type of debt. All right, someone also could be actually speaking up in a relationship and letting you know, or you letting another person know that you're unhappy. You don't see yourself able to grow spiritually, mentally, financially, physically with this individual, emotionally. All right, I feel like for some of you all, this also has to do with how much energy that you pour into your projects, your uh, people, places, things. There's a need for again. For you to really, really, really structure your fucks in the month of January, all right? Aries. Someone rising Venus. I am hearing paperwork. For some of you all, some of y'all have someone that's trying to rush you to make a decision. This could have to do with paperwork. I feel like someone's trying to sell you short, Aries, all right? So if there's a decision that, that, that can be delayed, especially if this is having to do with some type of outside of, like, negotiations that's happening around custody or some type of, um like parental care or some type of like child care it's something re regarding a family children the home okay and some type something that's old to you but i feel like someone's trying to short change your ass so be careful with signing any type of documents outside of court or making any outside deals all right someone rather venus house watcher mercury jupiter no yeah some of you guys are entering a situation with an earth sign Capricorn towards Virgo. I feel like for some of you all, you feel as if you're giving more than you're giving more than you're receiving. I'm hearing someone is bored in a situation. Okay, for some of you all, also be very careful when it comes to sending your money overseas. I am picking up this energy, something around overseas. Yeah, some of y'all is dealing with motherfucking uh, Scamula, Scamula, Am Scam Scamula Anderson and Scamula Ill motherfucking Jackson. All right, bitch, do your motherfucking research before you send that motherfucking money overseas. Because I definitely feel like this could have to do with some type of like clothing line 
fashion. This could also have to do with some type of wholesale product, all right? Be very, like, do your research before you send your money, my baby, all right? Because I see somebody getting scammed, all right? For some of you all, you're making a decision possibly between a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, or an earth sign. And I feel like you over both of that shit. You're really just going to choose to walk in your own power and to really just focus on your bag, all right? For others of you, there's a water sign, Aries, I'm sorry, water sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. I feel like someone's, someone's afraid that it's like actually over, all right? Someone's been very fucking stressed. I feel like someone's been wearing a facade. In, in your face, they, they, they try to tell you that everything's all good or they want to present to you or show you that everything's all good. But whoever this individual is, they feel intimidated by your growth. I feel like for some of you all, someone could have helped you start something or someone could have like assisted, like someone could have helped you start something and I feel like you grew bigger than this person could imagine and this person just remained, somebody stood in their own way. And I feel like for a long time, they wanted to blame you for it, Aries. But this person is now actually seeing things for what they are. And this person, they, they, feel like they feel that you're very powerful. They feel that you're a boss. But this individual, I feel like they also feel as if they don't have the access to you that they once had. Somebody had the game fucked up. Somebody got comfortable with a particular version of you that no longer exists. And I feel like whoever this is, they're not accepting the fact that there's a disconnect that's happening or that you're separating your energy from theirs. Okay? I am hearing cord cutting. All right? For some of you all I am picking up on a divine masculine energy yeah <clears throat> some of you all there could also be an apology coming in from someone who could have ghosted you I'm also picking up on an energy of an apology coming in from a patriarchal figure this could be a father a child's father okay um, this could also be an ex-lover but it's very masculine um, I'm also picking up on the energy as well if you're dealing with a Capricorn someone's holding on to some information like Someone knows that something occurred, but I feel like someone's not in a space of stability where they can take care of themselves. So I feel like someone could also be like get, becoming obsessed with trying to hack your hack your accounts. Aries, change your passwords. Some of you all are going to have to change your passwords frequently because some of y'all have, have a consistent stalker. All right. This is someone you definitely know. The first person who you thought of when I said this, your spirit is saying yes, all right? For some of you all, there's an air sign, Gemini Libra Aquarius. I feel like there's truth that's coming out about this air sign. Yeah. That's, that, and I feel like it's very, whatever this truth is, it's very freeing to the soul. I feel like there's some type of like, there was some type of, there was some type of like cycle that was like very, 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 um, toxic for some of you all emotionally okay again psychosomatic I feel like for some of you all you're attaching yourselves you're attaching yourselves from trying to fit the shoes that another person expected you to walk that another person expected for you to walk in or another person expected for you to feel because I feel like for some of you all you're accepting the fact that this is extremely emotionally draining all right some of you guys could be ending a situation with the water sign cancer Pisces Scorpio strong emphasis of Scorpio I am hearing what's done in the dark will come to the light all right some of you all there could also be some type of unexpected money I feel like someone could be someone could be stressed out about telling you some type of secret regarding money somebody could have fucked you over in the past or was attempting to fuck you up but they're in a space where they're stuck they need you to either respond a certain way Aries in order for their plan to go and I feel like for some of you all someone's trying to start up some damn drama with your ass but you're not responding at all so it's sending this individual back to the motherfucking drawing board okay somebody's telling you that they love you but this person loves the access they love they love feeding off of your motherfucking power this is definitely a water sign cancer pisces scorpio some of you guys could be dealing with someone with the initials b j r o t h all right yeah some of you all are on the fence about sh <clears throat> when it comes to a relationship. For some of you all, this has to do with a job, okay? Some of you all are choosing to completely abandon something, to start something new. But I feel like whatever this starting something new is, Spirit is really wanting you to focus on your movement forward, mastering your craft, okay? So some of you all could be taking your damn vacation time that you have left at this damn job off before you decide to completely 86 it, all right? I'm also picking up on the energy as well. Yeah. Some of you all are setting boundaries as it pertains to your heart, matters of the heart. Some of you all have an opportunity for new love, but I feel like there is some type of trauma that's being triggered for you in the month of January that's going to free you and make you see things. There's, there's self-realization here when it comes to matters of the heart. I'm also hearing secular, 
secular. I'm also hearing Saturn return. Some of you guys could actually be ending ending cycles around or uh, ending some type of Saturn return lesson. Yeah. Some of you all, there's an Aquarius that wants to talk. This person wants to reconcile with you. They want to apologize to you, Aries. You could have children with this individual. I feel like someone finally sees that you're on your path. And again, someone, someone doesn't have any substance. Someone doesn't understand or appreciate your substance. And whoever this individual is, uh, I feel like this person... They don't have a purpose in life. Their purpose solely is to block your motherfucking purpose. I'm literally hearing your true north, okay? I'm also picking up on the energy of... Some of y'all could be wanting to expose the government. Some of you all could also be wanting to share your subconscious revelations or your prophetic dreams at this time as they pertain to these vaccines and the collective as well as the fucking wicked ass motherfucking conspiracies that these people have planned for our children, okay? I'm literally hearing missing children. Someone has a particular gift here where you can lost where you can find what has been lost. I'm also hearing missing children, okay? Yeah. For some of you all, you choosing to you choosing to separate, you choosing to speak up about walking away from a particular situation is raining in blessings. You manifest whatever is ending, spirit is saying that you manifested this. I am seeing a, a vision of open doors, okay? And there's a lot of light behind these doors. For some of you all, I am hearing breaking into a new industry. So some of you all this could have to do with modeling, this could have to do with music, this could also have to do with some type of creative expression, also the expression of your gifts, okay? The sharing of your gifts. Yeah, there is a Gemini that is internally internally fucked up. I feel like someone thought that something was going to continue on. But yeah, Aries, you pulled the plug on this motherfucker. I'm also picking up the energy of a Virgo that doesn't know if it's safe to trust you with their heart. And I feel like you're on the fence when it comes to this person because you feel like someone's too damn clingy. Or someone needs your, they need your attention too much when it comes to validation. Alright? So let me get a soul lesson, a soul journey's lesson message for you all. <clears throat> all right. Big emphasis on uh, protecting your content, Aries. Someone could be trying to steal something from you. All right. You guys got pride. Some of y'all could be dealing with the Leo. I love myself and I see myself in everyone, okay? I feel like, again, Spirit is wanting you to see the situation from both sides of the fence, okay? Have an understanding, but don't have so much of an understanding that you lose yourself in somebody else's madness, okay? You guys got discipline. I can accomplish what I set my mind to, focusing, pulling your energy back. You guys got purpose. I know what I'm here to do, all right? Following your intuition, really focus, really focus forward, and not really worrying about anything. You pulling a fucking, put, put, Pulling a damn plug, okay? And hitting the brakes on anything that's coming from your past that does not serve your greater good. Your greater, pretty much the greater good of yourself or others, okay? Or that in which you have to offer the world. Lastly, you guys got service. I feel good when I can help others. For those of you who have your own business, for those of you who are spiritualists, I am seeing an influx when it comes to your business, okay? So I am seeing that things... Things are turning around for you guys, Aries, in a very positive way, but it, this, this feels like a lot of sacrificial gains. What are you willing to sacrifice in order to become successful? For some of you all, are you willing to sacrifice your lineage or sacrifice the gifts that, that, that has been bestowed onto you, okay, through your, through your lineage for a fucking relationship that you have to be take a realistic approach and just see that it's not going any damn where. This person's whole fucking purpose was to block your purpose. And for some of you all, you're coming into in tune and being 1,000% sure about what it is that you're here for and spirit is saying it's time to move there are no more delays the only delay that you will experience is the delay that you cause your damn self by standing still okay it's the time it's time to move aries and walk in your truth all right whatever that may look like all right so you guys i pray that this message finds you with love i send you all peace happiness many blessings if you need a personal reading that information can be found in the description box below if you have not followed me on ig already what the hell are you doing at mocha underscore love underscore tarot it's weekly motherfucking tea over there all right but i see you guys um for the month of february and i love you long time